Recorded live in Austin, Texas, USA, it's The William Montgomery Show. Starring William Montgomery. With the Tony Chin Orchestra. The William Montgomery Junior Dancer. As always, William is joined by the lovely Erica. I'm Brett Erickson. And now, here he is. The Big Red Machine, William Montgomery. Yeah, I have hip problems. Yeah. My hip, yeah. Stinky hip. Yeah. <laughs> Is it hurting right now? Stink hip? Yeah, it hurts. <laughs> I've heard of that. Mm -hmm. Stink hip. Stink hip. Yeah. <laughs> got shit veins. Yeah. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> I shouldn't curse like that. <laughs> Yeah, I was trying to solve a cold case. I had a dream. I was like trying to solve a cold case. Like, uh, did you end up solving it? No, there wasn't enough leads. <laughs> <laughs> Were you? Uh, was it like True Detective? Yeah, but it was in like uh, it was in the place where the fighter was, Lowell, Massachusetts. Oh. <laughs> That's just like That's where the dream was. <laughs> yeah, it was based where the fighter, the movie is based. My dream was based there, and. Yeah. Uh, yeah, I just followed up on some sources I had, and it, <laughs> they couldn't, unfortunately, too much time had passed, you know, since the first 48 hours is the most important, so. It totally is. I thought you were going to say because you woke up or something, but it was. No, I, well, probably, <laughs> yeah, I don't, <laughs> I don't know if there's a causation or a correlation, but yeah, I woke up, and I know that I was, I spent all night trying to solve that case, so maybe. You might have. Yeah, maybe I did in many ways. Yeah, maybe I solved the case. <laughs> you probably did. I know, I'm being modest. <laughs> <laughs> you probably solved the case. <laughs> what was the case? Was it a murder? Yeah, this girl, she was a working girl, and uh, <laughs> she unfortunately passed away, not by her own hand, and she was slain <laughs> in a hail of uh, bullets. And I tried <laughs> to solve... Uh, yeah, I just had like, I remember I had like a source called Little Tony and uh, <laughs> Little Tony and the, and the PP gang. And I was like calling all these people. I just remember like calling all these people in my office. Damn. What were you wearing? Do you remember? <laughs> I, don't, I don't remember. <laughs> Probably like a, like a nice, like a stocking. <laughs> kind of like a toboggan maybe. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's just like revisionist history. Like that's what I wish I was wearing. But yeah. I don't know. Fair enough. Grant, did you have a cool dream last night? Nope. God, we to throw it off. Uh, <laughs> Did you have a cool dream? I didn't have any dreams last night. I haven't really, I haven't remembered my dreams in the past couple of weeks. I don't know what the fuck is going on because normally I can remember dreams, but the past couple of weeks I haven't. Uh, Are you smoking weed? Yeah, I've been smoking weed. Maybe that's it. But I had been smoking weed before and I was having dreams. Oh. And then it's just like recently I haven't been having dreams and i wonder what the fuck is going on uh you should get that checked out yeah i don't have health insurance so <laughs> <laughs> it makes not it hard dreams. what do i do yeah. <laughs> tell your your doc you're not dreaming <laughs> doc i don't know how to tell you this yeah. <laughs> i stopped dreaming <laughs> oh. okay cat is our guest today cat thank you <laughs> i said that weird cat thanks so much for being here <laughs> Uh, Casey, this uh, is your girlfriend. Yes, this is my girlfriend. Hello, Cat. Cat, <laughs> this is your boyfriend. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> this is ambush journalist. Uh, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> no, you're so Casey. sweet to come on. Hey, thanks for having me. This is exciting. Yeah, that, thank you so much girlfriend. for coming on. And this is my girlfriend. Yeah. Erica just refuses to be behind the fucking camera, and it's a cause of concern around the household, and I think that's why I'm not dreaming. <laughs> no i'm kidding but yeah now we have the uh it's like a double date right now it, it yeah. totally is yeah. that's fun and so grant's cool. the chaperone <laughs> yeah grant are you cool to be the chaperone today or as long as you guys keep your distance from each other yeah cool <laughs> <laughs> what <Cool>. oh, <laughs> leave i'm just saying leave room for jesus mm. <laughs> like middle school <laughs> yeah, it sounds like middle school, Grant. Yeah, we're all grown up. Oh, okay. 
Well, <laughs> yeah, come on, Grant. Let whatever happens in here happen. What the hell? Why are you even talking about? You've already been throwing it off. You told me your fucking backstory right when I walked in here. <laughs> That's all we have been talking about last week. And then you just tell me about your back right when I walk in. I'm sorry. It's fine. I'm glad it's better. Well, you're, <laughs> you said your knee is, is fucked up. Probably. Yeah, my knee is horribly hurt. I ran on a treadmill for a little bit last Wednesday, and it really messed something up. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> I know. I just need to get on my bicycle or something, because I have been do- I did the Stairmaster, then I fuck up my sciatic nerve in my back, <laughs> and I feel like a real <laughs> dumbass. <laughs> the Stairmaster, and then I'm running on a treadmill and hurt my knee. I don't know what it is. <laughs> yeah. You gotta be safe on those things. You go to the gym, or you have you have all this at home? Yeah, we have a couple treadmills at the apartment. It's like a huge apartment. <laughs> <laughs> There's ghosts in there. <laughs> there can be. Oh. There, can, <laughs> there can be. There Luckily, there haven't been recently. No ghosts. Is there a ghost where you live? I don't think so, but I think my bathtub, I think something is is going on with my bathtub. <laughs> yeah, she wanted to have it saged. <laughs> <laughs> oh, seriously? She got a spook tub. Well, <laughs> oh, <wait. laughs> she got a spook There's tub, just dude. something about it. I can't get in it. I can't bring myself to get in it because. I, I, oh, my gosh. Had that ever happened before with the, any bathtub you had ever been around? <laughs> no, like I love I love baths, but there's just something about this one that feels feels wrong. Spooky. <laughs> the vibe is all the vibe off. Is off. <laughs> this I was tub. telling my oh friend my about it and she was like, oh, you what you need is to have someone come over and do an energy cleanse and cleanse it with positive energy and sage it. So no one, no, I haven't done it yet. And also there's little tiny roaches sometimes that come out of the drain. So that could be why it's (laughs) upsetting to me. (laughs) (laughs) Have you ever been around the tub, Casey? I've been in the tub, but only standing. I don't take bath. Do you get weird vibes in there? (laughs) Yeah, the vibes are totally fucked, and the, and, and oh, the, yeah, no. yeah, and the scene's dead. Scene's dead. Scene's dead. So I, was, I hate that in a bathroom when the fucking scene dies. That's awful. That's I I tried to take a big bubble bath the other day for like my fifteenth anniversary working at uh, the car dealership, and I was seriously. <laughs> <laughs> it was a special day, and I and I tried to take a bubble bath, and I and I dozed off, and I noticed as I was dozing off, this big spooky hand with freaking knife yep. or finger. Damn, come out of the bath, try to freaking grab me, pull me under. You didn't tell me about that. God, get out. Did you get out? <laughs> I think it's Freddy Krugerman. Yeah, I got out immediately. Yeah, Freddy I... Krugerman. <laughs> I was trying to think. I was like, that sounds like a movie. Yeah, Freddy Krugerman. <laughs> I was like, I think that sounds like a movie. <laughs> I was thinking you maybe were going to say the Ghostbuster scene where the slime comes out of the... Remember that? <laughs> and Dan Aykroyd has sex with that ghost. Yup. Uh, yeah. 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 Ghostbusters? Can confirm. Uh-huh. They made out and had sex and she's invisible. Uh, so cool. Was yeah. it first Ghostbusters or second Ghostbusters? I think that's G1. Yeah, G1, I think. That's I think. G1. Is that, I haven't seen that movie. Does yeah. that really happen? Mm-hmm. Yeah, it's one of the most spectacular human <laughs> ghost sex scenes on cinema. Wow. Yeah. There's that man on fire. But Denzel Washington. There's a has, ghost fucking scene yeah. in that? He has sex with that girl. Okay. okay. Right. That was so, so weird. weird. Yeah. <laughs> it like didn't have a lot to do with the movie. But yeah, Man on Fire is like an intense movie. No. When that have happened, you seen man. It? Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. Oh, I love that movie. And then he winks at the camera and he goes, It's twins. Because we can't see them. So we're like, we have to take his word yeah. for it. <laughs> awesome. <laughs> what is this? What just happened in this movie? <laughs> Get back to the story. Denzel. And so, and he goes, I did. We've all finished, and then it just kind of cuts. And so they never cool. find them. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> they never find them. They never end up finding them. Well, I don't know. Yeah, I mean, I think maybe you need to get somebody over there ASAP. Yeah, with the sage. Do you know anyone? <laughs> yeah, Erica actually, she sages our place all the time. Yeah, no. What is that stuff? You've lit something on fire before. It's just a little Palo Santo stick. It smells good. Oh, is that the little wood stick? Yeah. Oh. It's like how it smells. Where do you get those? Amazon. Okay. That's for attracting ghosts. Yeah. I would not do that. (laughs) That's why we've been doing it. (laughs) 
Have you seen a ghost before? Never. Only in all the time. Only in dreams and, and then at, at, at shadow people. Periffs. Oh, are you sure it's not like glaucoma? Is that a is that something that happens if you get glaucoma? Yeah, you get little floaters in your eyes. Ooh, I get those floaters all the time. <laughs> <laughs> Do y'all get floaters in your eyes? Yeah, I have pre glaucoma. <laughs> You ever get floaters, Casey? Not like y'all do. <laughs> <laughs> do you have them right now? Um, I'm trying to even see. Yeah, I have floaters right now. I totally. I don't think I have any. I think it's mostly in the sun. Yeah, I remember when I was a little kid. <laughs> I was on the playground and I looked up and I could see like I thought there were germs, and I was like, "Oh my god!" Like, <laughs> oh no! Like I've been blessed with an incredible <laughs> talent. <laughs> 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 like I want to share this with the world. <laughs> And I told my sister, I was like, Chelsea, like, I don't know how to tell you this, but I can see germs or whatever. <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> and I was excited. Like, I thought she was going to be excited. And she was like, you are so dumb. Those are not germs. <laughs> <laughs> and I was like, you don't. I was like, I wish you could walk a mile in my shoes and understand what I've experienced. Yeah, I wish you could see what I see. Yeah. And that's the great burden of being human, not being able to share that with someone. I know, even with your sister, you would assume your sister, just close no. relative, she would understand. And she would believe me, a victim. <clears throat> yeah. Seems like to this a day. Thing. Yeah, is what? it genetic? I wonder if. Hmm. Could be. Yeah, maybe she was in denial. Like she was like, no, those aren't germs. That's crazy. But we can actually see them. As she's seeing all the germs all <laughs> around. Right. She's just trying to keep it cool. <laughs> like, wait, what do you mean? <laughs> Rocket family secret. <laughs> <laughs> she's just trying to keep it cool. <laughs> <Ooh>. Germs. <laughs> 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 Grant, what did you put up there? That's a germ, right? It looks like COVID. Yeah, that's COVID. Yeah. <laughs> cool. Good God, man. <laughs> yeah. Would you say COVID is a germ? It's a virus. But is a virus a germ? Yeah. Germ seems like a pretty broad term. Yeah, germ seems real broad. Grant, yeah. what's the deal on that? Uh, I don't know. Is I'm... COVID a germ? <laughs> I'm a, I'll, I'll look it up, I guess. I think all COVIDs are germs. But not all yeah. germs are COVIDs. Yeah, uh, uh, viruses uh, and bacteria and whoa. fungi. <laughs> that was <laughs> profound. <laughs> Wait, what was that again? <laughs> all, <laughs> all COVIDs are germs, but not all germs are COVIDs. Mm -hmm. Damn. That Damn. is correct. You have chills? She's not wrong. Kind of. <laughs> 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 uh, it's like something. Well, no. All right, I'll say it. It's like, <laughs> like every time you go dookie, it's pee pee time. But every time you pee pee, it's not dookie time. You know what I'm saying? No. Wait, can you say that one again, though, right. too? Because it does sound profound. I promise. Well, you that. I saw it in a tweet. So when the when you go doo doo, like make a stink, like yep. it's always pee pee time. But when you go pee pee, it's not always stink time. That's like, yeah. right. Too. That's totally true. Yeah, really? and that was what I said. That was good. What do you mean, yeah. really? That's totally true. Not every time you tee tee or you doo doo. Maybe for boys because they're sitting for the doo doo and they can stand for pee pee. Well, we have two girls in here. Do y'all? What do y'all do do every time you tee tee? No, I think. Well, I thought the first dookin'? one was like if if you go doo doo, then you're gonna tee tee. I always tee tee before I doo doo. You do. You tee tee before you doo doo. I don't think I've ever doo doo. <laughs> 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 Wait, do you poop? <laughs> Grant, pull that up. Yeah. <laughs> what do you do? Do you poop on your pee or do you pee on your poop? Uh, I shouldn't have brought this up. I think. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Good question. I don't know. I think I probably tee tee a little and doo doo. I don't know. Unless do if I really have to do. Unless if I really have to do do, then it's probably doo doo and tee tee. Right. <laughs> what do you do, Casey? Oh, man. Uh, yeah. So I like. <laughs> I have a really good metabolism, so yeah, whatever y'all do, I do too. Yeah, yeah, so, yeah. <laughs> probably even more than that. So <laughs> yeah, <laughs> have, have you ever heard about them thing that you put? Well, yeah, it's getting gross. You put it in your stinker hole, and then you yeah. can dookie like shapes, like you can like duke like a star, really? like a cookie cutter, but yeah. for your asshole, <laughs> it's like a cookie cutter for your booty. Yeah. <laughs> oh my no. gosh, I've never even heard of such a thing. It exists, and also, this is something I just thought of right now. What if you ate one of those little capsules that you put into water that makes a little dinosaur? Yeah. What if? What would happen then? 
If you just ate one of yeah, those? Yeah, if you just ate one. God, I wouldn't try it. I would. <laughs> it would expand. It would probably hit your stomach acids. It'd get huge. That's oh, true. God. Just at the rave. You don't just think your stomach Just pop some of those dino tablets. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Wait, where do you find those poop? Shape cutters, oh, poop stars. Yeah, what is, I've <laughs> never stars. heard of that. It comes out of you like that. Sure, whatever you guys think. It was on Shark Tank. I do remember the Shark Tank. <laughs> yeah, I think I remember the Shark Tank for it. Shark tank. Wait, so I, what is it? I was getting. T- <laughs> <laughs> what? Wait, what? What were y'all just talking about? I what were y'all shark saying? Tank, but <laughs> we don't have to. We have our own language, like <laughs> twins. So we're just. Oh. <laughs> we, y'all really. Well, it's mostly just riffs. It's just, yeah. She's are like, y'all riffing a lot? Are you doing it right now? Tell them the truth. Yeah, are y'all, do- are y'all riffing right now? <laughs> <laughs> tell them the truth. Never tell. A lady never tells. <laughs> <laughs> fair enough, fair enough. <laughs> you, guys, you guys riff, huh? Uh, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, we riff. It's like, yeah. Right. Don't you think? Yeah. <laughs> Do you think? Yeah. I try to riff. Sometimes. Yeah, we riff sometimes. <laughs> yeah. Every yeah. now and again we'll riff, but I think it was on Shark Tank. Yeah. <laughs> Wait, so what happens? You put something in your butthole and then it shapes whatever the tube is inside of your butthole. It shapes that tube. Yeah, to be like a <laughs> is that the Grand Canyons? <laughs> yeah, what's that? Is that Grand Canyon? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Is that supposed to be a dookie hole? <laughs> and uh, yeah, so I can tell you, like, without getting into it, like, I have yeah. really hard, like, rabbit pellets. So that wouldn't work for me. But it's all the time you do? Yeah, it's just the way I'm really just the way I'm built. But <laughs> William was teased for that. For rabbit pellet poop. Yeah, dude. He it, never we lived were, it down. We were pranking a house one night, and I doo-dooed in the paper <laughs> sack, and then it turns into little rabbit pellets, and then they all make fun of me, Alex and Zane. So he does the, he does the thing, so but it didn't even matter because his poop was pellets, so they hated it. <laughs> yeah, they were just like, we're not even like, doing it anymore. <laughs> I was excited to see a fucking lit up bag of shit on somebody's front porch. So they didn't even do it. It's not enough volume of shit. Yeah, there's not enough. <laughs> yeah, we're just not going to do it. Guys. Oh, my God. Do you think you can get custom shapes, like your signature or something? <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Whoa. Like the Declaration of Independence. <laughs> your John Hancock. <laughs> Casey. <laughs> Casey Bones Jones Rocket. It's really long. Oh, that'd be so beautiful. You could, you could freeze it. Oh, cool. <laughs> you could. Gross. I guess you could. It's always an option. <laughs> so what? You don't think you could though, because your doo doo can be hard at times, or but it's hard all the time. <laughs> Casey, drink some prune juice or something, <laughs> man. Yeah, that's I not know. good. I didn't yeah. know about that. <laughs> I'm backed up. <laughs> 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 yeah, but I, so I think whatever mechanism it uses, like whether it be like alchemy or like a physical object, I don't think it would work. I think the dukes are too hard. But guys like yeah. you, you know, I would love to see you. Something I like could that. maybe do it. Yeah. <laughs> Some shard art. Shard art. God, I doo-dooed on, uh, if we're just talking about doo-doo, I doo-dooed on Saturday. And <laughs> when it came out of my butt, I was like, oh my gosh, that seemed explosive kind of. And then there was doo-doo on the side of the toilet. And then it, I didn't have like immediately get it off. So it was just on there. And then when I was leaving the room, I thought, ah, should I try to clean it off? Or, and I was like, nah, <laughs> fuck it. <laughs> I'll let them deal with it. And I felt kind of bad, but I just walked yeah. out. I didn't give a shit. I was like, I'll let them fucking deal with them. Just yeah. shit everywhere. <laughs> no, it was just in the inside of the toilet a little. I don't know. It's weird. Man, fuck all the drama. I'm out of here. <laughs> yeah. Scene's dead. Yeah, scene's dead. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Bye-bye. You smoking a big Cuban cigar. <laughs> Bye-bye. Bye-bye. Have a wonderful night. Take the robe. <laughs> hey, bang. I'm out of here. <laughs> yeah. Kat, what's your... Uh, uh, Favorite classic hotel, hotel chain. <laughs> oh, good. I thought it was going to be a different question. Yeah, what do you think it was going to be? What her Something poops are like. Dookie related. Hmm. Not that type of podcast, huh? <laughs> yeah, we're not. Yeah, tra- yeah. We t- we kind of talk. <laughs> yeah. Uh, my favorite hotel. Wait, no. Chain. What is so? What's your doo doo like? <laughs> is it solid or? My favorite or? hotel chain. 
Um, I mean, I recently got introduced to a Motel 6. Cool, that's which, a classic. Yeah, I mean, they're not good. You know, they're pretty bad hotels, but I like the idea of them, you know, like. You need to stay just, someplace overnight. Yeah. You're happy they exist. Yeah, <clears throat> I mean, it was really bad. It's really loud. We couldn't get into the room because the key didn't work. Oh, like, no, and, so you weren't able to ever, were you ever able to get into the room? We had to get a guy, the guy from the front desk. I thought you were about to say we had to get a gun. <laughs> That's what I shoot the log off. <laughs> yeah. Like an old treasure chest. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> uh, yeah, and the guy went back. I thought he was just going to come out and help us, but he went like into the <laughs> secret back room and came out on the other side of the stairs. Uh, and then he let us in, but then... Uh, then they came in at like 10 a.m. And I don't think we checked out till 11. And they tried to come in. And... So it's a bad experience, but I... Did y'all have the thing on the door that you do that you latch so it's just like a loud noise oh, when no. somebody's trying to get it? <laughs> <laughs> I don't think they have those. Let me clean. <laughs> yeah. Deadpool. Yeah. Yeah, Motel 6, you know, sometimes they don't... Yeah, they don't do privacy that way. The, yeah, they leave the light on for you, but <laughs> they leave the light on, but they will not turn it off. It's yeah. very bright, <laughs> and they'll, they'll come. They'll, they'll, they'll come check on you <laughs> periodically. Make sure you guys doing okay. It's like 5 yeah, from the other room, the <laughs> guy was in from the other door somewhere. <laughs> he was a murder. You guys, secret door. You guys sleeping okay? <laughs> <laughs> what the <is it>, fuck? <laughs> You guys getting some good rest? Cold nothing here for you? <laughs> Cold enough. Put a little peppermint on my chest. I woke up with a little peppermint oh, on my chest. chest. <laughs> so scary. <laughs> yeah, that's always the best. Not a little chocolate on your pillow or whatever they do, but a little peppermint <laughs> on your chest in the morning. <laughs> that's the Motel 6 promise. <laughs> a little morning peppermint. <laughs> yeah, I was in Paris, Texas. Yeah. Mm -hmm. They got the place. comedy club out there we went and did. Yeah. Nice. Yeah. How was that? It was fun. There's like 15 people there or something. No, there were 20. 20. <laughs> <laughs> no. Where is Paris in relation to here? How far away is that? It's like near Dallas, right? Yeah. Like 45 away from Dallas, maybe. Yeah. Where was it? At like a bar or at a... It's, where's the show? It's a, a bar club. with no drinks. Yeah, it's a club, but it's like... A, uh, what do you say, DIY? Like It's like a little stage and like these kind of rickety chairs and called Tower City, but we had a lot of fun, and they do a great cool. comedy festival there. Yeah, yeah, it was cool. Yeah, I'm yeah I've surprised. heard of that, yeah. Have, you haven't done that out there? I have not, no, no. I was surprised they were into, like, into my comedy stuff, because I've only really performed in, like, Metro Plexus, or Metro... <laughs> Cool. <laughs> movie theaters. <laughs> yeah, Metro. <laughs> She's only. I only perform in Tinseltown. <laughs> in IMAX. Yeah. <laughs> the IMAX and Tinseltown. Where is Tinseltown? Are they gone? Do Isn't they there a Tinsel? What do they call Tinseltown? Isn't that a name for a place? Is it's that like not called a Hollywood, chain? right? Is that Hollywood? Ho there's Hollywood and there's. We had Tinseltown in Beaumont. I don't know. What does that store do? It's a movie theater. It's called oh. Tinseltown? Tinseltown movie. No, I'm I'm meaning just the general Oh the name name Tinseltown. What is that in reference to? Maybe I don't know. Grant, what is it? Do you know? <laughs> <laughs> Casey, you brought that gun back, dude. <laughs> <laughs> I just got the freaking burner on me. You bye got that bye. thing loaded up? You already know it, buddy. Shit. You got one in the chamber? <laughs> yeah. No, dude. <laughs> yeah. I actually blocked you. You know it. <laughs> <laughs> you already know I got that thing on me. <laughs> uh, no, safety always on. <laughs> That's smart. Except that yeah. one time. Except that one time. You, oh, yeah, yeah, I shot myself in yeah, the head. Yeah, he shot it against the wall, and then it, like, boomeranged back into his <laughs> eye. Yeah, it, was like a three two, it was like a Three Stooges thing, yeah. <laughs> I shot it at the table, and it hit the table, hit the wall, and hit me right in the middle of the forehead. I was like, oof. <laughs> I made this stupid noise. Oof. <laughs> Ow. <laughs> Ooh, ow. <laughs> Ouch. <laughs> <laughs> so dumb. Owie. That's Owie. funny. What is y'all's, if y'all are having a night on the town, what is y'all's favorite <laughs> place to eat? To eat? Yeah. Well, Casey only likes to eat meat and cheese. So yeah, I'm very selective. 
<laughs> so are you a picky eater yeah just meat and cheese so like hamburger cheeseburger sandwich <laughs> hot dog sandwich um are you kidding no just meat and cheese that's what i like we like have to eat some fruits and vegetables Ooh, yeah why well, eat apple yeah <laughs> apple <laughs> yeah, I was thinking, what the fuck is apple? Okay, an apple. Yeah, apples are pretty good. Put some peanut, dip them in some peanut butter. <laughs> Y'all ever do that? Yeah. The, yesterday. <laughs> uh, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> That's actually, I don't know how you knew that. That's one of my favorite restaurants. That's true. They have some of the best skillet quesadilla, the queso dips. I love the queso. Mm. I was about to say the queso. It's pretty good. So good to eat. Yeah, Casey likes Indian food, though. So we'll get Indian food. Oh, yeah. I love Indian Classic. food. Very good. And when I eat Indian food, I do not have rabbit pellets. It no. falls right out of me. But I like tiki masal. So good. That's a new development. Just figured this out four or five days ago. It was that the first time you'd ever had it? Yeah. Pretty so cool. what happened in the past? You had heard about it. You just weren't interested? Or what was the deal? Why hadn't you ever tried it? I go, I'm going to wait till I'm older. I go, you're what? <laughs> wait till I'm older. <laughs> Oh, <laughs> I go. I gotta save some things. Like I'm saving The Sopranos. I'm saving Tiki. So yeah, we <laughs> started yeah. watching that. We got so like we two have... episodes <laughs> in, and I was I like, "What know. is this?" I, I know. Like... I'm like, "What's the big deal?" <laughs> we don't get. Why it. does everybody love this? I watched two episodes. I'm <laughs> we... like, "What?" <laughs> Maybe we should watch more. I don't Maybe. know. I didn't like it. He, I couldn't get it. I don't like the We're voice not... he does. I just got your bit. <laughs> it's not like that, but it's there's close. the one guy in yeah. it, one of one of the Italian actor guys who it's like such a caricature of. Is it the gray hair guy? I can't remember. I don't remember. It's just some guy who it's like I'm watching him and I'm like I don't believe him. He's acting like some <laughs> mafia person. I I can't remember who that. Wait, how many episodes did you? How much of that did y'all watch? I've only I'm the only one that's watched. I've that. only watched like one episode. Yeah. Oh, wow. yeah. I watched like I three seasons like during COVID, but we can't get into it. Yeah, I was drinking a lot, so I don't think I really remember that much <laughs> <laughs> what happened. Oh, but, that's funny. <laughs> but um I don't I love mob shit though. Like I am so jealous of like New York accents. Like I want one so bad. I feel like I'd be so What's much your fun. best yeah, what's your best New York accent? Oh, God. Hey, <laughs> or what is a New York accent? Gabagoo. Hey. <laughs> hey. Hey, what hey. the hell are you doing? Yeah. Hey. <laughs> hey, fuck you. Yeah. Like that, right? It seems yeah. good. <laughs> that seems That's... like a good one. <laughs> it's a classic. Hey, put another shrimp on the body. <laughs> so good. <laughs> another shrimp on the Barbie. <laughs> Hey, what are you doing over there? Put a shrimp on Bobby already. Oh. <laughs> so cool. There's a lot of Australian people, I think, in the Big Apple in Tinseltown. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Is that Tinseltown, the Big Apple? The Big Tinsel. <laughs> the Big Tinsel. <laughs> Would you ever put tinsel on your uh, Christmas trees growing up? No. Would my you? My mom had all these like fancy ornaments. But mm. I put tinsel on my Christmas tree. You cool. Do that? Mm. We haven't had one. We yet. haven't had. God, why would you? Why'd you ask that? <laughs> uh, <laughs> yeah. What a loaded. No, question. no, I'm kidding. I don't. Yeah, we just haven't. We haven't had one. Mm -mm. We'll put uh, decorations up. Mm -hmm. Will y'all ever put decorations up? We have not spent a Christmas together. No, this will be our first Christmas. Nice. But That's gonna... exciting. Are y'all already thinking about what presents to give each other? <laughs> <laughs> yes. <laughs> I love Christmas. The wheels are turning. Yeah, well, I think we're going to watch The Grinch. We the love Grinch. The Grinch. <laughs> love him. Fave. And he's so mean, right, Kat? But what does he learn? Yeah. Jim you... Carrey's Grinch? Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's Apparently. the last one. Did you guys read about what he went through to do that? The makeup? Yeah. Yeah. They couldn't breathe and shit. Yeah. Oh, really? Yeah. They had like a. I thought he turned into Andy Kaufman or something, actually. <laughs> I think that's. No, funny. that's stupid. That was the other movie. That was another movie he did. Man on the Moon. <laughs> He's still doing Andy Kaufman on the set of The Grinch. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> what, are you guys, what are you guys doing? <laughs> yeah. or whatever Andy Kaufman did. Yeah. Hey, it's me, I'm Andy. <laughs> yeah. That was his whole shtick. Good morning. I, I think they brought in like a torture. Uh, a torture, like, uh, what do you like, a uh, therapist or something for Jim Carrey on the Grinch? Uh huh. Like people who underwent torture with like the CIA or something. They brought in one of those guys to help him motivate him 
Just because of all the shit they had to put you on You just sit there yeah. for hours. Eight hours or something. I don't get Yikes. it. Yikes. Just what, for fucking like Dr. Seuss. Do thank thank <laughs> yeah. God for CGI. What the fuck was he thinking? For fucking Dr. Seuss. Dr. I'm glad It he... wasn't Dr. Seuss. It was the redheaded guy. What? I'm talking about the just the uh, idea of the original Grinch. Who's the redheaded guy? Princi- Wait, the redheaded Ron guy? Ron Howard. He did Principal Grinch. Seuss? Oh. Yeah, he was the first Grinch. <laughs> Principal no, he James. Didn't. He made the He's movie. the director. Uh, Ron Howard. Ron Howard. Rest in peace. <laughs> Rest in power, Howard. <laughs> yeah, Rest in power. Rest in Howard. <laughs> That's so scary. I don't like that. <laughs> Eight hours? That sounds awful. Yeah, for fucking Dr. Seuss, for, for fucking that? Ron Howard. It's so good, though. It's Baby good. Grinch is so good. It's yeah. kind of cute. You kind of like boop his little nose. He's so cute. Yeah, but he's got a dark side, doesn't he? <laughs> he's got a lot yeah, of he's demons. A real dark side. He's got a lot of demons. But towards the end, he'd look at Cindy Lou Who, he'd go, Christmas ain't so bad after all. It's true. <laughs> I know he has a change of heart at the end. Yeah. Is that what happened with you, Grant? I know you used to hate <laughs> Christmas. It was very similar. Very similar experience. What happened? Because I hate Christmas. No, you, you, you hate Christmas? To... Uh, I think I just hate, well, yeah. I don't why like do you holidays. hate Christmas? I don't like I don't like being around my family. Oh really? Yeah. Casey, have you met her family yet? No, not yet. She doesn't like being around them. I yeah. really I don't. She doesn't allow me to see them. My- <laughs> I think it would happen. I bet it would happen at some point. <laughs> sure. Yeah. I just like, you know, I just thought my It'd probably parents. be fun. Maybe for Christmas. Yeah. My dad's cool. My dad's a cool guy. He plays drums and shit. Cool. But uh yeah. I don't know. My mom told me I can't say the word fart. Last weekend, what like in like doing stand up stuff or just generally no, speaking, just just talking. <laughs> no, Can't say that. Is she kidding? No, she's like it's not ladylike. You have to say toot. Well, I agree with her on that. <laughs> <laughs> I think I agree with her on that one. Your mom's not half bad. <laughs> she's got some good ideas. <clears throat> oh my gosh, that's kind of funny. I hear you. That's interesting. <laughs> she would say that. I mean, that seems. I don't know. Seems kind of nutty. I hear you. But I was telling Kat that my mom, when I was growing up, oh, yeah. I said fart, and she goes, "We don't say that in this house. We say beep." She said, <laughs> "Oh, really? <laughs> yeah." And That's I was like, funny. "No one's ever said beep <laughs> ever." Beep. Yeah. Oh, I beeped. I'm so sorry. sorry I beeped. beeped during that work meeting. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Excuse me, guys. I beeped. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> That's so funny. God. Yeah. Kindred spirits. If you haven't heard already, it's smooth sack summer. Yep. The leader in below the belt grooming is making sure we all have a ball this summer, or even two, on our (laughs) ball sacks. This summer, by getting our pant partners everything they need to stay fresh. And I don't know if y'all have heard about the Manscaped Performance Package 4.0, but it has it all. It has, hold on, did you know this cat? It has the lawnmower mower 4.0 body trimmer, wow. weed whacker, nose and ear hair trimmer. I did that in my nose and it actually made me sneeze. <laughs> they Love gave me sneeze. some. Whenever they send a package, I'll give it to you. And you had a, I don't know if you try, I don't, I don't necessarily. You had some hair in your ears too. Stuff. But on my body, yeah, I have all these big hairs growing out of my face now. Not necessarily, I don't necessarily do stuff with my pubes, but I do stuff with, I have to, I have big hairs growing out of my face <laughs> that I have to do stuff, yeah. which can be a nightmare, but that's why Manscaped was pretty much invented. I mean, it helps you, whether it be your private parts or your big hairs coming out of your face in different places, your ears, your nose, your mouth. <laughs> Eyelids, tongue. <laughs> yeah, tongue. <laughs> Fur teeth. Cool. Fur teeth. Uh, but yeah. Man, I, <laughs> you, you, you know what always gets me is Manscaped. It's, all the products are waterproof, so you could use them in the shower. The pool, wow. the lake. Yeah, use them at the pool. In if the you have, rain. If you have a trim job you got to do in the pool, do it in a Vegas pool. Yeah. At the MGM <laughs> Grand Casino. You, you can, can do Oh, they it have there. a lazy river. That's actually a good place mm. to do it. Cool. 
Yeah, yeah, get your Manscaped stuff. Go to the Lazy River at MGM Grand. <laughs> you can do it in the Lazy River at MGM Grand. <laughs> yeah. You are allowed to do it there. Yeah. Stuck to some band-aids. <laughs> they have signs, yeah. God, isn't that always horrible in a Lazy River? Band-aids. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah, you get up out of the water, there's yes. a Band-aid on your face. Uh, but yeah, go to, <laughs> go to manscaped.com. Use code WMS. 20% off. Did you hear that, Casey? 20% off. We doggies. And free shipping. Free shipping. Whoa. 20% off. It sells itself. I'm kidding. Isn't that like a sales tactic? Just saying it sells itself. It's like they're paying you to buy it. Yeah, they're almost paying you to buy it. <laughs> 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 what? Okay, but yeah. Uh, <laughs> Manscaped.com. Go to WMS. 20% off free shipping. How are, how are you guys as parents? Good? Good. Yeah, doing good. Yeah, yeah. I feel like Francis. Uh, Is that your mom's name? She's probably a similar lady. Similar type lady. I remember one Christmas, I, sp I sprayed the Christmas tree with bug spray. <laughs> and killed with it. my buddy Dillard Butler. And then, yeah, killed the tree and... My mom oh, came wow. back and she had to throw out all the ornaments. It was oh, bad. Man. We went up into the Devastating. attic and there was a drum, like a drum Santa Claus was going to give my brother, but we saw that. So that was kind of the beginning of the end for Santa Claus. It was a rough, <laughs> it was a bad Christmas. One time we all got food poisoning. Oh God. It did some place on uh, Christmas Eve and all got bad food poisoning. A lot of uh, liquid doo-doo. Everywhere. Call, call back. Wait, yeah. was that bad to leave the shit on the toilet in that hotel room? Do you it think? was inside the toilet. Yeah, I think they got to clean it anyway. It's fine. Well, probably not, but my a my roommates. Work. Remember my roommates used to oh, do that. Oh yeah. Oh god. <laughs> we don't have to talk about it. But yes, used to do what? Somebody leave, in my, leave the doo doo. Somebody in my home that I was living at, uh, every single day, there'd be a streak of dookie down the back of the toilet bowl to where I started like- Oh my God. Like, like <laughs> it was an every day, you know, I try to, oh, I don't want to get too graphic, but every day, like I, it's, I like, I try to clean it, you know, maybe I try to pee it off or something, right? Yeah. yeah. And uh, um, nature's target practice. And yeah. <laughs> the next day it would be a brand new sludge of duke at the same spot. So I'm thinking like his butthole's like in a weird place or something. Yeah, was it just squirting yes. out? I wonder if it was Sticky how that or been something. going. Sticky or something, yeah. Yeah, it was a lot. It was bad to live with. I mean, what are you eating? Did like you ever it, say like, anything? Make it like loop like that. I don't understand how he was <laughs> sitting to shoot to the very back. Like what position is Maybe your butthole Maybe he sits all in? the way back on the seat. That's true. Maybe he's really taking a load off. Yeah. Like Maybe he's, he's on really... an SSRI. Oh, and it's like lowering his sex drive. <laughs> no, that makes you that makes you do. Oh, it does. Yeah. SSRI. Yeah. Cool. Good to know. Yeah. I've just been using enemas. <laughs> <laughs> My mom used to put them in me, but she no. but she says she claims she didn't. Wait. But she did. <laughs> Isn't that weird? She what? acts like she never did, but she used to. I remember Why? being on the bed <laughs> and her giving me enemas. Yikes. Oh yeah, and she tries God. to pretend like it never happened. Why? Can you believe that? Honestly, no. She wants That's to the forget weirdest it. Thing. Huh? She doesn't want to remember that. It's the weirdest thing. She refuses to <laughs> fucking believe something that totally happened. Why would I mean, how am I supposed to feel? <laughs> <laughs> she's taking that away from me. I know it happened. Yeah, she's gaslighting you. Yeah, is that the definition yeah. of yeah. gaslighting? Yeah. You go, I remember you used to stick that friggin' thermometer stink thing in my butt. She go, what are you talking about, boy? Yeah, and I'm thinking in my head, wait, you used to. <laughs> She's like, what are you talking about, boy? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> what you doing, boy? You get back there and solve that murder, boy. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. That's how she talks. <laughs> Always making you go over case files. <laughs> get back in there. Look at the cold case, will you? Okay, sha. <laughs> okay. Okay, sha. <laughs> are that's you from Texas? Uh, from Tennessee. Oh, that's right. Where are you from? I'm from Texas. I'm from Beaumont. 
Where is that in relation to here? <laughs> it's uh, east of Houston. Cool. It's a bad place. You didn't? Did you like growing up there? Um, yes and no. Like I don't. Uh, there's just a lot of like cancer and shit there, and like. Paper, Why is that? Is that for paper a reason? Mill. There's a paper mill close. It smells really bad. Have you guys ever smelled a paper mill? No, but I've always heard about I want to. It's I've gross. always heard about that. <laughs> it's out in Evadale, and you just wake up one morning, and your whole house just smells like rotten eggs. What are they making? Paper? Yeah. I wonder why. Why does that? Why I wonder why making paper that smells so bad. bad. I don't know. Grant, look it up. I'm kidding. <laughs> Grant, why did I even talk to you like that? <laughs> Grant, are you familiar with paper mill? Are you sleeping back there? He's not talking. <laughs> I, I was getting a paper mill graphic for you. That doesn't look like it would smell bad. There's yeah. a paper mill up in Waxahachie driving north. It smelled awful every time you yeah. pass it. Right? It's super nasty. Paper never smells, though. No. Yeah, paper doesn't have that much of a smell to it now that I think about it. Well, they bleach it, right? Do they bleach it at the mill? I don't I don't know. Don't look up paper mill disasters. I've seen people get <laughs> stuck in those things and they oh, start yeah. spinning real fast. Your body. And... I saw that on your mom's house podcast. He gets <gasps> turned into that pink was a goo. Paper mill? Oh, see you saw that. I saw that. Yeah. She was horrified. I don't think he lived either. I don't think, yeah. Yeah. I don't think so. Turn into pink dust. Bye bye. Nice. Think that would hurt? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, it would have to hurt. Probably so make you scream. Yeah, I'd probably be screaming. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Stop the paper. Trying stop to flatten the you into paper, paper right? <laughs> yeah. Oh, like then you Stanley. stink for eternity. That is what happened to Flat Stanley. People don't know that. <laughs> it was a young boy. It's you know Flat Stanley? No, who's it. Flat Stanley? The paper mill boy? What are we saying? <laughs> Flat Stanley. <laughs> Kat, you take the lead on this. <laughs> yeah, I think I've Kat, heard. I know you. I've heard the name. I just didn't know exactly who Flat Stanley was. It's just a tragic story of a boy. Uh, no, it's no, it's a guy. <laughs> it's this, it's this piece of paper. <laughs> it's like a shaped like a boy and painted like a boy, <laughs> and you take him places like, like oh, here's Flat Stanley in in the Capitol. It sounds like we're making this up. <laughs> Is this but we're like not. a hashtag? Yeah. No, no. He's oh my gosh, horse. Flat Stanley. He could probably go anywhere. He yeah, actually that's can. That's his whole thing. He's very yeah. portable. He can go under door or on the wall. Yeah. And Flat Stanley, I remember when he visited my school, everybody was very excited about it. And did I, he really visit your school? Yeah. And he came oh in my. the mail. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. 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 It was so cool. And everybody gathered around, like, that's a real Flat Stanley. And, like, oh, it's him. Yeah. Was he saying anything or literally just laying on the piece of paper? <laughs> Hello, boys. Uh, oh. You know, he don't talk like that. But he's small and he has a piece of paper, so he's, he's a boy he's the a size of, of a paper. I don't think we had Flat Stanley. Yeah, I wasn't familiar with Flat Stanley. Hmm. Is that the guy who did the Grinch? <laughs> <laughs> Who's that again? Doctor Seuss. Ron Howard. No. <laughs> <laughs> Ron Howard do Flat Stanley? Probably. <laughs> have they made that into a movie yet? I wonder. <laughs> did he direct Flat Stanley? <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> I think Ron Howard did direct Flat Stanley. Now I feel like I made the, all that up. Flat Stanley. Hey, no? don't you start doubting yourself. <laughs> I know I know Flat Stanley Yeah, personally. Yeah, no, you Flat saw Stanley? Flat Stanley. I literally met Flat Stanley. That's true, that's true. And he was as flat as they say. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, piece of paper, that's Very so flat. flat. Very thin. Very thin. Gust of wind could have ended his whole shit. I wonder but where I... he is now. I wonder if he's still with us. God willing. God, and the creek don't rise. <laughs> Isn't that the same? <laughs> what does that mean? Love you. God. Yeah, I don't really know. God in the I've creek. I thought don't about rise. it. I don't really. God willing, in the creek don't rise. I like it. Whatever it is, sounds cool. It sounds in threatening. It's an American slang expression implying strong intentions, subject to complete frustration by uncommon but oh Jesus, never mind. That's a lot. <laughs> but not unforeseeable oh, events. Keep reading. You're really adding to everything. <laughs> <laughs> Please. Cat, what is your? I'm kidding, Grant. God, I'm sorry. My knee is killing me. A little late, but uh, Tinsel Town's in reference to L.A. Knew it. Oh, it does. How? <laughs> Just a nickname for it. Oh, okay. Look up uh, like flat, big easy. flat Stanley College football stats. 
Okay. <laughs> Good idea, yeah. Yeah, I want to see where he went to school. I think he went to Nebraska. I think he's a whole corn husker. I, I think, think he right. might have gone to Nebraska. <laughs> Come on, Flat Stanley. Cat, what mm-hmm. is your uh what is your favorite joke that you tell right now? <laughs> or what is one that you like? Can I hear one of your jokes? I've never seen you do stand up. No, no. Okay, if you're not comfortable, I'm just wondering. <laughs> I was just wondering if you. Had... I don't know. I tell a joke about birds that I think is kind of funny. What do you say about birds? Just that I hate them and that. Um... <laughs> What's your beef with birds? <laughs> they just fucking suck, dude. They're, They're so annoying. They're loud. They, I used to live in this house, and there was this... little feet. Yeah, they're so scary. It's like, why even have feet if they're gonna look like that? But uh... <laughs> <laughs> yeah, why if you're gonna look like that? Why would you have feet? Right? Nobody's Don't. buying those feet pics. Paint your <laughs> like, toenails or something. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> Freaking talons are so scary. Talons. <sighs> Good morning. Yeah. <laughs> Well, so, so there are a few birds that I had problems with throughout my life. <laughs> well, in this house I used to live in, there's this blue jay that would scream at me from the tree that was right outside my house every morning. Have you guys heard their screams? No. I yeah, yeah. I remember loud. I've heard blue jays before. And what was it doing? Trying to get your attention? I think he, he's just annoying. Like, I don't think there was any purpose. <laughs> he was just like, you know, freaking out. So yeah, every morning I'd walk outside and he just fucking, Burr. and then uh, yeah, there's this other, Damn. D- this like dove that would like dive bomb me and my dog when we were walking. <laughs> we had to escape <laughs> him a few times. Like he kept like dive oh my bombing like my dog. And that's then, weird. Yeah, <laughs> uh, <laughs> that's scary. And then one time a bird shit on. Oh me. my gosh, how many? Of these That'll birds? do it. Hold on. <laughs> It's an ongoing thing. I mean, I've probably been shit on by at least six birds. Oh my god, Nuh-uh. so many. Yeah, happens to me all the time. Oh my gosh. Yeah. Where are you standing? Then they look. Where are Stand you? Directly under bird nests all the time. But I don't think they're. <laughs> yeah, yeah, where are it sounds you? like they love you. Is that how they express love? It's a it's kind of rude. Yeah. <laughs> it's kind of rude. It's like a kiss. Yeah. I remember one time my friend. He was like, oh, "I got to take a phone call. Can you watch my dog?" Yeah, and so he goes, and then as he walks away, and I'm holding his dog, a bird shits on my shoulder, and then he comes back, and he's like, "Yeah, my mom died," and I was like, "What? Whoa! <laughs> well, it was very, you know, I was like, why would the bird do this to me now? Because now I have to figure out a way to go wash it off before it starts drying up, but I have yeah. to like be here for my friend, <laughs> so that was a tough." Think it had anything to do with the mom dying? You think it was the bird? bird. Like that <laughs> happened, and then the mom died. <laughs> oh, <laughs> the other way. Around. Yeah, the other way around. <laughs> like the bird might have had something to do with it. <laughs> Yikes! Well, that's weird. Those yeah, are really some weird sad. bird things. Yeah. Right. <laughs> there was an owl in my parents' neighborhood that would attack people. Yeah, <laughs> owls that's attack terrifying. people like the staircase. Yes, <laughs> that's what happened. Oh, was that what he's one of his yeah. things was? That was yeah. an owl that killed her. Oh gosh, a lot of people but think. The, but on it, what it happened? The staircase. What's Michael, the staircase? Pe- Michael Peterson. Peterson? Yeah. No, is that the guy? Yeah, Jordan Peterson. Not Jordan. <laughs> Peterson. A lot of there are multiple Petersons. <laughs> a lot of Petersons. Jordan Peterson got that way because he was attacked by an owl when he was a boy. A, lo- a lot of people don't know this: an owl killed JFK. <laughs> I heard they were around. Yeah, a little freaking really? BB gun. That's weird. <laughs> bye bye. Kiss God for me, he said. Um, Kiss God for me, bitch. <laughs> back in. Kiss this. Wait, what happened with the owls? I shouldn't have worn green on my shirt. That's a bad idea. Yeah, Casey, why didn't you tell her? What happened with the owls? With the green. No, about oh. the green. You should have. Looks oh, great. man. Looks awesome. Now you got a little little, little speck of owl on you. cool. You know, every time it changes, it'll be. I know a green screen. I didn't even, I still don't get how that works. <laughs> how is there literally, I don't get that. Science isn't there yet to tell. Yeah, science isn't there yet. One Did you know mysteries. anyone that got like mauled by an owl in your parents' neighborhood? Um, not in my parents' neighborhood, but a family friend. He was jogging, and an owl went down and swooped at him, and he tore his knee up. 
<laughs> trying to avoid the owl. Oh God, Steve Hennessy and William <laughs> Hennessy. They all he sells cars in Atlanta, Georgia. He was some buddy of my dad's growing up in high school, and they every Christmas they would come around. David Old English. <laughs> 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 I was remember when we first started dating. I sent her this picture. I was in the parking lot of El Pollo Rico. And oh, yeah. <laughs> I think it was like I was like it was a special occasion. I was like treating myself to a quesadilla, and I had my quesadilla. And my window was open, and then I felt something hit my leg, and I looked, and a bird had somehow shit through my window onto oh my, my leg. It's a big old <laughs> splatter. Oh my god! Yeah. It's very gross. And I sent it to Kat. She said, lose this number, ditzoid. <laughs> <laughs> she called me a ditzoid. So well, cool. Damn harsh. Yeah. She's playing hard to get. Harsh. Yeah. But you didn't know at that time. Did you know about all the bird issues? Yeah, you didn't know. I didn't. We hadn't yeah. talked about it. It took a while to crack that open out of her. <laughs> yeah, it <laughs> took a while. You didn't know. <laughs> I think I texted like 15 things in a row to get the the picture off my screen because I was yes. so She's like, <laughs> ew, no. Don't How's the quesadilla? Gross. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Don't send stuff like this to me. Has yeah. Casey sent you that? Um... <laughs> Katy Perry? <laughs> no, no, there's this ad on Instagram. <laughs> what is it's not going to be funny it. to explain. We'll send it to you later. Basically, this girl, it's a solitaire game, but at the beginning, <laughs> it's like a cartoon of this girl, and she like farts really big, and then it like, gets into the solitaire. It's like an ad for a solitaire game. Isn't those Dude. cartoon ones? Yeah. yeah. Why are they so weird? They're so weird. Oh, yeah. I don't get it. I think I do it. remember seeing that. Yeah. What is that? I don't get it. So she weird. farts, and she's like, ha, ha. And then her <laughs> grass grows, and then she mows her grass, and then solitaire pops up, and we're like, what? Part They're of that. always a game. Yeah. It's always a dramatic <laughs> cartoon and it's always a game. Yeah. It's and then I think one of them was they picked up this girl who was supposed to be like a really hot like sex pot or whatever. And then always they, <laughs> sex pot, maybe. And then they pick her up and there's just green fumes coming from her feet. Like she has really <laughs> stinky feet. <laughs> And that's for the solitaire that's company. For the solitaire. Game. Yeah. <laughs> it's so uh, I'm trying to play fucking si spider solitaire. <laughs> not worry about people's smelliness. Oh. Yeah, it's like you don't need other stuff with solitaire. You can just play solitaire. That's so funny. Yeah, it's hilarious. Spider but, solitaire. Did y'all did y'all play that growing up? Like on the. I used to there they are. I those got... stupid ads. Yeah. yeah, they're yeah. so funny, dude. Help her. Oh, she farted. Oh, <laughs> yeah. help her. Get her out. Her feet stink like butt. <laughs> so gross. <laughs> Weird. What is y'all's, um, what's y'all's favorite restaurant? I think I like Chewy's. Oh, Chewy's is good. He loves Chewy's. Yeah. I like chicken fajitas. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Come out like sizzling. <laughs> Oh, yeah, I love to make a scene in the fucking... Last time we went to Chewy's, we sat in some girl's memorial booth. What? Uh, do you what? remember yeah. that? Yeah. Do you remember that? Yes. <laughs> it was her memorial booth, and I'm trying to enjoy this case. Like she used to sit here every Saturday. What does that mean? Like, she died she there? Died. At that Chewy's. Yeah. Booth. Or she I think she ago. died in the booth. We were trying to figure that out. If she actually did die, it was a bad vibe. I didn't like it. Yikes. The second I realized she died in that booth, I was like, I'm like, get me out of here. Let me go to Pluckers a bunch. Oh, Pluckers. So <laughs> uh, yeah, we live right by a Pluckers. <laughs> That'll give you BT. <laughs> butt trubs. Yeah. yeah. I was about to ask what BT was. Butt trouble. Okay, okay. <laughs> <laughs> What's your favorite kind of wing? Ooh, I love the chicken. Get chicken, chicken, chicken wings. I'm just being bad. Tots. We have, I don't know what the flavor's called, but we. I have a little inside joke with the uh, 
the, the one waiter, of the waiters there about the hallelujah apparently it's really bad and then so william would be like oh i ordered the hallelujah so every time i see him i'll say <laughs> or I he'll go the over bad kind that, he told order? me not to get <laughs> and he kind of laughs but it kind of makes me it makes me laugh a little <laughs> so i just keep saying it to him whenever i see him and we see him there every time every time wow we're there every tuesday thursday i mean we're there all the time Game. Is it the, i'm yeah. kidding well, <laughs> i don't want to dox you or out you guys it's the one that has trivia night. Okay. Yeah, it has trivia night. Trivia's fun. Yeah. We're not really good at it. <laughs> not it's any really good hard. at it. Yeah, there's so many questions. <laughs> um, yeah, there's how many? There's thousands yeah. of questions, probably. It's like only questions. Yeah. No, it's weird. I kind of don't. Only get questions. It. <laughs> so rude. <laughs> yeah, I don't kind of don't get it. We don't get it. <laughs> Nasty. I'm trying to eat. I'm not trying to answer all these fucking questions. Where am I? Pluckers or Barnes and Nobles? Where am I? Where am I right now? What is this, a Dillard's? Why are you asking me so many questions? Yeah, what is this, a Dillard's Warehouse? We went to uh, Dillard's Warehouse. Dillard's Warehouse. What? Where they keep all the big clothes. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> the tall suits for the tall people. <laughs> it's the Dillard's Big and yeah. Tall. Dillard's Big and Tall. My brother Vance had a shop there. I don't want to dox him right now, but yeah, growing up, he had Vance had a shop at the Dillard's Big and Tall. It was so embarrassing. How tall is he? I'm kidding. I'm just feeling embarrassed <laughs> still from the shitting in the bag. I'll never fucking... <laughs> <laughs> Never live that one down. It's literally like a weekly so thing. Funny. Those two buddies still text me about it. Yeah. All yeah, these years later, years. 20 years later. What do they say? Just how's your shit? <laughs> 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 I'm like, how's stop doing this. With age? <laughs> yeah, it's like, stop. I've, I'm telling you it's fine. Stop. <laughs> you got to take my word on this. You leave me and my wife alone. Yeah. Then I have to get Erica to do do in the toilet, and then I take a picture of it, and then I act like it's mine. That's romantic. <laughs> I know it's sweet. There was one time. Maybe y'all try this sometime. There would be one time we haven't done it in a little while, but Erica would we be do it all the time because we were you were drinking all the time. Yeah, I used to love Erica would sit down on the toilet and start teeing, and then I would pee in between her legs. Oh, that sounds fun. Like at the I bonds. Like what? At Vaughn's or yeah, CVS. Oh, like in public? <laughs> That's that right. It would be in the at the CVS, at the Vaughn's. Wow. <laughs> He'd be like, can I teach you between your legs? I'd be like, I guess. <laughs> you were sweet to let me do that. Yeah, you're such a sweet person. I was really considerate. Yeah. Uh, no, I haven't done that, but <laughs> you should try I, it. Sounds fun. I'd rather do it the other way around, where I'm sitting down. And <laughs> yeah, yeah and you right. have to sit on my lap That's and just tee tee down. <laughs> just piss down my thighs. It gets everywhere. <laughs> yeah, it's, I'm soaked in piss. Then we could take a haunted bubble bath. Oh. Y'all got to be careful about that bath. I know. <laughs> I know. Haunted hot dog. Yeah, don't you? I have a haunted chili dog when we're done. <laughs> <laughs> okay, cat, we brought you. Uh... Don't knock over all your drinks. Yeah, for anybody watching, I've had four drinks in rotation this entire time. Why is that? That's weird. So much caffeine. You drank them all too? Nice. He's. Uh it's, it's a horrible hard. problem. I'm a crazy person. This past weekend, I just had pitchers of soda water, <laughs> literally, and it scared me at first because I didn't pee. It took. I went through a whole pitcher and I still wasn't peeing, and I was like, "Is something wrong with me?" I saw you at Secret Show in the green room, and and you had like seven <laughs> bottles of sparkling water around your feet. And I was like, "Dog, how much sparkling water are you going through?" It's truly Isn't that weird, Casey. Why am I doing that? I don't know. It's some weird nervous habit or something. Yeah, it's well, I do that too. Because if you can't drink, you're like, wait. So what? Are you not drinking? You said you were drinking during COVID. Do you not drink, or you yeah. drink some? Yeah, no, I, I don't, I can't drink anymore. How is that going? See, not drinking? Totally um, fine. Good. No, I don't like it. <laughs> no, oh, okay. I miss drinking. But, it's not for uh, her. <laughs> but you know, I just can't, I just can't, can't. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, I got a, a substance abuse problem. So. <laughs> <laughs> I hear you. I should have done the ketamine on Saturday night, but I did, and I just started drinking. I got drunk as shit. I didn't yeah. tell you that part, Erica. No. Really? Good I, for you. I'm no. kidding. Oh. <laughs> so you've been sober for a minute, huh? 
Yeah, for a little. I just had to. It's fine. Yeah, it's whatever. It's fine. I try to watch the fucking Sopranos, but we can only get through two episodes. Yeah, we don't get it. That one guy, I wish you could... uh, Pull up the cast. We'll watch another one. We'll tell you. Pull up the cast, granted, the Sopranos. It's this one guy who just seems so cheesy. I don't know. I I don't know who the fuck it is. Is, is it, it that guy? Is it this guy? Polly Walnut? No, not not no. Polly Walnuts. <laughs> that Polly creature Walnut. behind him. Polly Walnuts in these old rags? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it's not him. Okay, we got you some toxic waste brand bears. Delicious. Oh, yum. Wow. Sour and chewy. It's I part of uh, Pro- Professor Sour Noggin. <laughs> <laughs> it's part of the really? Professor Sour Noggin universe. Well, it, <laughs> it really is. Wow. <laughs> Sour noggin. Casey, where do you even find these? Casey said you love those. I do. Yeah. Well, I haven't had these specifically, but. Yeah, it's part of the Professor uh, Sour Noggin. He got them on delicious. He found them on eBay. Seriously? Mm-hmm. Yeah, don't eat them. They're like 20 years old. <laughs> <laughs> oh, thank you so much. <laughs> yes, yeah, this guy. It's this guy. Uh, Who is that? I don't remember. I don't like that guy. <laughs> it's, it's Steven Van Zandt. Do you like him? Yeah, he's great. You think he's good in The Sopranos? <laughs> yeah. No, he's not. Is he the guitarist for Bruce Springsteen? Yeah. How about really? that? I know a lot. Oh, of is he? Facts. I know a lot of cool That's stuff. Wild. What? If you only thought that, you know that. <laughs> I just know a lot of fun facts about various things. Yeah. He's a guitar player. Yeah. yeah. It, like for example, uh, another fun fact, Professor. Hagen Noggin was a yeah. he's a Gemini. Is yeah. he? Yeah. I thought you were... Yeah. Uh, Hagen Noggin. <laughs> what yeah, is Professor Sour Noggin. Noodle Noggin. But it's spelled like sauerkraut or something. <laughs> yeah, they spelled Sour. it all weird. Sour. Professor Sour Noggin. Uh, it's part of the Professor Sour Noggin universe. They're from Brazil. What? I so, caramba. Brazilian candy. <laughs> I cabron. <laughs> <laughs> Well, Kat, thank you uh, so much for being on. Thanks for having me. Thanks You're for very you sweet. Guys. Thanks. Casey, so mu- thank you so much for getting her on here. It was nice for both of y'all to be here. Yay. Casey's been so sweet to uh, start doing the show with me. Yeah, he loves it. Yeah, it's been a pleasure. Great. I hope I'm not bothering him too much. Remember last night, I was like, what should I text uh, Casey? Oh, God, he had a whole... <laughs> he's like, I'm going to be bothering him. <laughs> oh. He's going yeah, like, to He's gonna expect me to always be asking him things like this, but this is just no, emergency. Just, <laughs> yeah, I was being crazy. I just didn't know. I'm, Do I just have me to... being crazy. <laughs> so I have to explain why I'm asking. I don't like, just know, just keep sending a text. He gets, yeah. <laughs> It was no. a whole thing. It's so funny. <laughs> yeah, it was like a two-hour fucking ordeal. <laughs> yeah, it was like, have you texted him? Should I text <laughs> like him? Should I wait till tomorrow? <laughs> <laughs> should I call him instead or maybe hit him up on Instagram? <laughs> it was a whole thing. I should send him a birthday cake. <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> should we order a pizza? <laughs> cool. Well, Kat, thank you uh, <laughs> so much for being on the show. Where could people? Me. Where could people find you? The gas station by my house. Uh, cool. <laughs> what is it? A Sitco or? Um, <clears throat> I think it's a C Mart. There's a C Mart, and then there's a Seven Eleven we go to all the time. Yeah, so great. It's down the. No, I, I have a. Seven. I have an Instagram. It's Satan's underscore feed pics. So. Is it really? Yeah. God, what does your mom think about that? She doesn't. I blocked her. Oh, there you go. Funny. Yeah, I mean, you have to. Yeah, you would just have to if there's somebody. Yeah, I'm sure it's yeah. fine, but right. That's probably a good idea because I'm sure she would hate that. It's my life. I'm kidding. I, I know. Oh, my gosh, I'm kidding. <laughs> it's my life. Yeah. Uh, and we have our podcast coming out oh, on yeah. Thursday, the Grimace, Ooh, Grimace Half Hour power, power Hour. That's Jinx. wonderful. That's such a wonderful name. Yeah. Yes. Casey, I didn't come up with it but yeah i did like 90 episodes with my buddy uh, then i stopped so now i remember you saying Catford. something like that <laughs> so what are y'all yeah. generally talking about just screwing around kind of well we talk yeah. we try to make um we do like grimace in the news yeah <laughs> grimace around the horn let's make up a story about grimace yeah it's a lot of grimace stuff and then we just kind of like 
egg each other on and get all freaky <laughs> crazy and <laughs> nice. Uh, that's great. Yeah, that's yeah, no, fun. Cuss at each other. Bring it's so presents. Fun. Yeah, we bring gifts. I brought her a chicken bone. I don't want to spoil it, but I gave her. Yeah, chicken no bone. spoilers. Yeah, yeah, yeah. On yeah, the yeah. ground at Seven Eleven. Yeah. Oh, I guess. That's <laughs> <a spoiler. laughs> and when was that on Thursday? Yeah. Comes out Thursday. Should be on Thursday on the Big Laugh Friggin' Comedy Network. Pretty cool. 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 Sounds good. Well, thanks uh, so much for being on here, Ken. Thanks for having me. Super fun. You guys are great. All right. Bye. 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 <laughs> Bye. <laughs> Thanks for joining us for this week's episode of the William Montgomery Show. Send your questions, artwork, and manifestos to the William Montgomery Show at gmail.com. Leave William a voicemail at 737 471 1098. Never miss an episode of the William Montgomery Show by subscribing to the William Montgomery Show channel on YouTube and anywhere podcasts are sold. Check out William online at william.f.montgomery1 on Instagram. For more William Montgomery, check out Kill Tony on YouTube and see him live at the Vulcan Gas Company in Austin, Texas every Monday night. For more of me, Brett Erickson, check out Issues with Andy on Patreon. Find me on Twitter and Instagram at ibretmypants. This episode of The William Montgomery Show was recorded at Permanent Record Studios right here in the heart of Austin. The William Montgomery Show is produced by William Montgomery and Brett Erickson. The William Montgomery Show is a Fanny Co. production. Thanks for joining us. See you next time. Shh. Who the fuck said that? I'm trying to have fun tonight.